Hi, everyone. So uh, I'm trying to use the new MetaHuman Creator tools. There's a MetaHuman meshing system now that should let you take um, your scan and um, turn it into a MetaHuman. I've been trying to do it with Reality Capture, which, as you can see, has quite a lot of detail um, just from some photos. But I've been having to uh, have trouble with meshing everything. So I couldn't use that one. Um, the best one I've gotten so far is this one. Um, which actually looks okay, except for the fact that there's a big giant white block coming out of the back of my head. So, so far what I've done is in Unreal Engine, um, I went through in here and I used the meshing system to create this head, which I kind of love. I'm not even going to try modifying it right now. Um, I just love that this is my first Frankenstein metahuman thing. Uh, basically what it does is it auto aligns or it figures out, you know, the basic shape of your head and where your eyes and mouth are. And um, I've got a frame somewhere in here. How do I get to my frame? Um, how do you an identity solve? Was that it? I think it already did that. Um, there's a little part where it'll show you the um, the mouth and the eyes and all that good stuff. Um, let me just, I'll just do what I did again. So the idea is that you go to your neutral pose and you try to um, use a, a low FOV camera like 20. And then you try to make sure you can see the whole face and then you can do a plus. Oh, there it is. It's already there. I was going to do a plus, but there's frame zero. And you can see that um, my camera's locked right now. I'll unlock the camera. But it, it kind of tries to uh, keep those markers in about the right spot. I, did, I haven't modified these markers at all. That's just where it got them. So that's pretty good. But you can see that when I put on um, that, it's like, I don't know what the heck's going on back there. So it's, it's doing its best to give me a head. And so now over in um, MetaHuman Creator, over here. Uh, this is what I look like. I think I look amazing. Uh, wonderful. Check that out. So let's go ahead and say edit selected and uh, and just start to play with this a little bit. So um, that's my face. And now I can just start to say, OK, let's use some of these higher quality um, textures. I mean, here's here's these pieces of me. You know, I can start to adjust these if I want to see. I can start to turn down up and down the influence of them. Um, enable editing, duplicate, and unlock, uh, allow access to sculpt, move. I'm not going to do that yet. First, let's just see if I can add in some textures. Let's see. Assign skin texture to enable this panel. Oh, here we go. Here we go. OK. OK. What's my skin tone? Well, something like that. Um, let's find a texture that feels like me. Um, I'm already kind of happy with um, some elements of this. Oh my god. I love this. Um, yeah, roughness, whatever. I mean, yeah, okay. I've, I've given up on it looking like me, but I'm just happy that I've created a custom metahuman with some real funky attributes going on in here. Um, let's try giving me some hair, some hair, something like this, maybe. Yeah, although my hair's, uh, my hair's pretty brown. Let me get a browner. <laughs> something like that. Um, and, uh, yeah, you know, one of these, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm just having a good time now. I mean, really let's, let's be clear here. The most exciting thing about this now is like some real custom meta humans we can get into. Let's give me my little, my little beard, uh, something like something kind of like that, I guess. Sure. <laughs> and, um. Yeah, I guess my skin's a little too dark compared to me. I'm see, I'm I'm Greek by heritage, and so my skin tone is all entirely dependent on how much time I've been spending in the sun. Um, the eyes aren't quite me. I've got some brown eyes. Let's just do that real quick. Proper brown eyes like that. <laughs> um, I've also got thicker eyebrows. Let's do some thicker eyebrows. And yeah, sure. Something like that. For those of you who know me on Twitter and YouTube, um, eye brews is in fact um, something I came up with when I was like 12 years old because I was like, I have much fluffier eyebrows than all the other kids. And um, I don't know, I guess I thought I was like pluralizing it or something by having this name eye brews. Yeah, sure. That's a, that's a thing. Um, let's give me some clothes. Um, proportions. Yeah, that's fine. Nice shirt. There we go. Nice bottoms. I'm ready to go. Ready to go speak at a conference now in my flip flops. 
my boots. <laughs> All right, great. Okay, I'm about about done here. Let's just see some some expressions. Yeah. Hey everyone, how's it going? You guys going to the party later? It's gonna be great. See the whole body set up. Yeah, see, we got all these different animations and everything. Ooh, artistic. Oh, yes. Oh, hello. I love this. <laughs> Man, what a world of possibilities this opens up. Ah. <sighs> Fear. <gasps> oh, no. But I mean, hey, you know, this guy's got character. He he may not look like me, but I, I want to use him for something. He's ready for for some kind of interesting show. Like I'd cast him in a in a theater piece. In a film. He doesn't look like all the other boring actors out there. It's good stuff. Um, anything else? No, it's, I mean, I'm good with that. This is this is great. I'm just really happy with uh, everything here. Let's just go through a few more animations. Um, fashion. Oh, fashion. Yes. Hello. We can do some different lighting. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Fireside. Yeah. I'm about to tell you a story. Let's try... Technical loops. Body ROM. I'm alive! Ooh. Why did you create me? Wait till the metahumans start asking existential questions about their reason for being. I mean, I I am very susceptible to um, anthropomorphism. And so as soon as our digital creations start behaving in a way that passes the, um, the Turing test, uh, I am going to be worried. And I'm going to want to treat them very, very nicely. Oh, look, little, little glitch there. Little bit of meshing problem there poking through the eye but i mean i'm not going to complain here guys this is this is remarkable i mean look at this detail from a custom a custom <laughs> sculpt of my head coming from reality capture did i mention it was reality capture also owned by epic and i've got this very distinctive guy um i'm happy i'm happy okay <laughs> that's all for now um wow all the metahumans got like something going on in their nose anyways that's it have a good day, everyone. Cheers. Bye-bye.